Nowadays, you'll find most people enjoying video games and animated films, both adult and child alike. These ever-growing art forms have a way of captivating us as an audience and as players, gaining our focus and our emotional involvement in the story and characters. But what is it that exactly grabs our attention? The visuals, yes, and the story and characters, of course. But there's also an extra element that remains to not be seen, but rather to be heard. This unseen element is the audio, the sound, or to be more specific, the music, and voice acting that are becoming present in more games and animated works. And though not all games have voice characters and not all animated films have jolly musical numbers, these sources of entertainment would be sorely lacking with the absence of the sound elements described. So exactly how important are these elements? Allow us to show you the positive impact the addition of good music and voiceovers have on the overall quality and experience of gameplay and animation. And that if it is an option, they should be included. An article by Psychology Today stated that gamers scored almost twice as many points while playing the first person game shooter Doom with sound on. Voice acting and music have a positive effect in video games. From having conversations in a virtual world to enjoying great music while attacking enemies, Sound is a major contributor to the overall quality of a video game. Voice acting brings a character to life by introducing his personality. While personality has been established, music sets the setting and the mood of the situation. I found myself enjoying soundtracks and playlists from video games that I've played in the past. So I'll just live my life of yesterday. Imagine Disney's Megara without the spunky, sassy voice provided by Susan Egan. And imagine Hayao Miyazaki's Spirit Away without its rich, award-winning soundtrack. Voice acting defines the personality of classic characters who we come to know and love and get, lets us get to know them and their relationships with other characters. While the music in the films transports us into their world and gives us a grasp of the mood of their situations, whether they be dangerous and dramatic, or calm and joyous. So as someone who plays video games regularly and also enjoys animated films and TV shows, do you think these would be the same without the element of music and without the voice acting? With anime in particular, I would say it would be a lot more different because uh, everything revolves around a good atmosphere. And if you take voice acting out, then you're, it's more of an interpretive piece. After, you should have music. Again, it needs atmosphere. That voices, the only issue is that uh, you had to have a lot of text, and so uh, that's what I feel. Animated movies and anime and video games are dictated by three things. 
the sound, the visuals, and the storytelling. So in conclusion, voice acting and music have an undeniable impact on the experience we have when we're playing video games and when we're watching animated films. If you want to see for yourself, next time you watch a film or next time you play a game, try turning off the sound for a little while and see if the experience is still the same.